Hey guys, it's Jedi Likes, and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be reacting to Extraction, which is the seventh episode in the third and final season of Bad Batch. And to me, episode seven kind of marks the halfway point because we are only getting 15 episodes in this third and final season, which does make me kind of sad because I'm not ready to say goodbye to Bad Batch. However, each episode that we've gotten has been absolutely amazing, and I've really enjoyed season three overall, at least thus far. And at the end of episode six, we did get to see Wolf, so I'm super excited to see how episode 7 is going to pick up and what events are going to play out in this episode. So let's jump right into it. How is he still alive? These are clones. They're not insurgents. They are both. Hmm. I wonder if because, you know, he sees that these are not insurgents and these are just clones, I wonder if that's going to be one of the reasons or factors that contributes to him turning and joining Rex, which we see in Rebels. He's not as sharp as he used to be. Get down. Oh. Don't worry. She only bites half of the time. Great. <laughs> that was funny. I've seen how you are with the kid. Your point? Well, you're different than you were on Ryloth. So, what changed? Loyalty meant something to me. But with the Empire, it didn't go both ways. I realized how disposable I was. You're not the only one. At least we're not the only ones that have noticed how much Crosshair has changed, and he definitely cares for Omega. He's definitely become, like, a big brother, and I think that it's kind of showing a little bit more than Hunter. Don't hate me for saying that. Oh my god. I thought he was gonna die. Thank god he's alive. <laughs> oh, Hauser saved him. That's awesome. Yo, that's a sick formation. Oof. Rex. I... I thought you were dead. Reports said you were killed in action. That you went down aboard an attack cruiser. Oh, I did. I lost a lot of good men that day. Dude, literal chills. That just gives me... <sighs> such chills. They're imprisoning and experimenting on our brothers. Killed others. The Empire wouldn't do that to us. I know you've been trained not to question orders. But open your eyes. You're hunting a child. I know that's not who you are. I think this is the beginning of him starting to question the Empire, what he's doing, and which side he should be on. Echo to save the day. There's literally no way. How is this guy still alive? He's starting to annoy me. You know, I thought that the end of the war would mean an end to losing more of our brothers. But I was wrong. Oh, there's the quote. Literal chills. It gave me chills in the trailer. It just gave me even more chills now. Crazy. 
So there you guys have it. That was my reaction to episode seven. And honestly, again, I'm going to say it. That was an amazing episode. I think that might actually be my favorite episode so far. I feel like every episode that we get, it just keeps getting better and better and better. And this episode was really good. I really enjoyed episode six because it felt very Clone Wars. But this one had a lot of action. And we got to see Rex and all of them kind of fighting together. We saw Crosshair kind of stand up and almost kind of sacrifice himself himself to save Omega and the group and he's even changed so much that even Hauser noticed a difference so honestly I thought that was an amazing episode it literally gave me chills quite a few times with some of the stuff that they were saying in the dialogue I feel like this is just written so well and I can't wait for the next few episodes to come out. But let me know what you guys thought of this episode. Did you like it? Did you not like it? I'm always interested in hearing from you guys. But I think that pretty much does it for this video. So as always, guys, thank you for watching my videos. I'll see you next time. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to drop a like as well as subscribe to my channel if you haven't already or even click to watch one of my other videos and may the force be with you.